him. Sharky, the time has come once again. Sure has. Unsheath that sword and, and let's get to dueling. Blades yep. will bleed. Joysticks will break. Controllers will get drift or something or other. Mm -hmm. You know, all those things that you associate with, with uh, intimidation talk. Hello. Wires will fray. Yes. <laughs> buttons will get Cheeto dust on them. A fate worse than death. Hello, everyone. I'm Cassidy. This is Charky. And we're mortal enemies for the purpose of tonight's stream. Tonight's Fight Night, the third uh, in, in our series of me and Charky fighting each other in fighting games. Uh, it has not gone great for me so far. I believe I've lost two in a row. But maybe tonight's the night where we turn things around. Or perhaps tonight's the night where I lose three in a row, and that's a hat trick for you. And then everyone will just understand that this is the segment that I lose regularly, routinely. <laughs> but you, uh, you have a chance tonight. I think you. Ha I'm looking at this lineup, and I think you definitely have a chance tonight. Um, I like to think I'm, so. I'm seeing speculation in the chat, so we're not playing Evils all tonight. Not tonight. That's going to be one of these nights, though, for sure. Uh, but the usual gimmick is that we pick three games each. One of them we consider a good game, and two of them are bad games. Tonight, I'm not going to tell anyone which of my games I consider to be the good one, and which ones I consider to be the bad ones. Because you might upset some people with some of your uh, hot Absolutely. takes. Absolutely. <laughs> That's right. Charky, you brought Street Fighter 3, and this game stinks! Uh, no, we, we have some weird picks tonight. Some that are known, some that are lesser known, and some that are known only to me. I feel like some that only I would would bother to play would bother to bring onto a stream like this. But uh, enough talk. We should probably have edit sooner rather than later, unless. Oh, that's right. I almost forgot. Uh, I do have something to interrupt the flow of the show. It's the stream snack. Thank you very much, Charky. Take it away. All right, tonight's stream snack. I'm br I went back to the Celsius Live Fit line. This is Fantasy Vibe Sparkling Mandarin Marshmallow Edition. That sounds fucking disgusting. Any marshmallow yeah, drink can't be good. I have no idea. I don't know if they meant like the artist's marshmallow or if it's supposed to be taste like marshmallow. We'll find out in a second here. Remember when Marshmallow had a promotional Coke can? Like it was Marshmallow Coca-Cola and it did not taste like marshmallow? I remember that. Now this, this tastes like they're going for marshmallow. Going for is key. Very, um, very light on the mandarin, very heavy on the marshmallow. <laughs> I'm starting to get Lucky, Char uh, Lucky Charms vibes off of this fantasy vibe. You rarely, if ever, want to hear that uh, in the context of a uh, beverage, a sparkling <laughs> beverage at that. <laughs> Uh, I'll finish it because I paid for it, but uh, <laughs> this is not one I it. think I'm going to revisit. <laughs> I'm drinking wine tonight. I'm drinking a, a Chardonnay, a 2022 Chardonnay. I can't say what brand because that would be uh, personally incriminating information <laughs> if I were to say where I got it from. But, uh, you know, for 20 bucks, not the worst I've had. Hmm. Well, barring any other updates, I think the time has come for us to get tonight's, uh, I was going to say festivities underway, tonight's fight-tivities underway. Eh? It's, eh? A, it's a festival of blood. That's what it is. Now let's go ahead and get up the fight night graphic. Oh, wait, no, that's the wrong one. It's, it's you. There we go. Cassidy is the fight night graphic. All right. So, seeing as I've uh, lost last stream, and the stream before that, incidentally, uh, I feel like I should pick the first game. I feel like I am still entitled to get the ball rolling tonight. Sure. And for my first pick tonight, I would like to pick a PlayStation game released 1998. It's Fighting Eyes... Developed by Bandit and published by Solon to a developer and publisher that no one here has ever heard of. Of playing a game that no one has ever heard of. 
But now, uh, I've definitely heard of Fighting Eyes. I've never played it. Have but... you? Did you hear about it through me? No, I heard about it prior to you. <laughs> now that's interesting. That strikes me as interesting. Let's make sure. Like I said, you... I never played it, so let's make sure you have a controller. Oh boy, howdy, you sure do. And it's doing my favorite thing where it puts us in the wrong slots. Okay. It's loading. Oh, okay. I was wondering, I can't read, so. Let's let this uh, demo play out of it a little bit. Get the story. Now, big Great thing about taste, this game... less filling. <laughs> now, a thing about this game to know is that it is very parry-heavy. It is all about pressing... It's a three-button fighter. Okay. Pressing those three buttons very fast, it looks like. Well, that's one of the super moves, which every character has the same inputs for their, their, two, their, their super. There are two stages... I know I shouldn't give too much away, but I am going to give away... Okay, that's I feel enough like of that. maybe the basics of how the game functions is fair game to give away. Well, let's see key config. Okay, Punch, this is a four kick, button game technically. Guard. Punch, kick, guard, step. Okay. I will tell you that to do a super with with some amount of timing. With some amount of window of opportunity, it is down, up, and then punch and kick at the same time. That's universal down, for every up. character. Which super comes out is contingent on how much your meter is charged. Okay. That's all I know. That's all you need to know. Let's jump into verses. Now, the sad thing is, I wonder if we'll have the character descriptions here. All right, we have Lundy, MC... Cindy, Kogetsu, Piro, Rick, Kloss, Phantom, Shark, Shimui, L, and Luo. All right, now do you have to pick your character before I can pick my character? Oh God, it's so it begins. Let's let's figure out what's going wrong here. All right, you are player two. Oh, let let, let me. I think I might know. No, it should be just vice type standard. Yeah, let's say standard. Let's say standard. Very good. Okay. All right. So the the format for tonight, uh, the format for fight night, is that we we check out as many of the characters as we can stomach. If that means all of them, that means all of them before we get to our final match. So let us pick. Who is most appealing to us right out the gate? Oh, I'm uh, going to pick who's the least appealing. <laughs> that's a good strategy, too. You know what? Yeah, I'm going to go... Circle to select. Okay. <laughs> First Colosseum. The fight is in your eyes, too. So they don't have the character descriptions here, which are great. Is he angel or is he devil? I believe is one of the lines in your character's description. No jumps. Do I... No jumps. Okay. Okay. Is guard just not active? Is it just like... You press X to guard. All right, so there's no animation for it, I mean. No, you, you the sound effect. Hit me. That's guard. Okay, so hit me. Try it again. Try it again. Okay, got like it. Like that. That's how you charge your meter. That is the only way to charge your meter, is to successfully no. parry attacks. All right, are there any uh, moves beyond like the special moves? Or is it just like stringing together punches and kicks? I have never figured this out. I know there's the supers, I could not tell you about specials. I know there's grab if you do punch and, uh, and guard, so that's something. All right. I mean, I have my meter built up, don't I? So that was my super. Oh, no, I don't. I'm looking at the wrong side. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's on me. My guy's gimmick, in case you haven't figured it out, is that he never takes his hands out of his pockets. He's the master kick fighter. So even when he does his super move, 
He did all that without once removing his hands from his pockets. Winner. All right, I'm getting a feel for this now, I think. There ain't much to get a feel for, as far as I can tell. All right, let, let's see our uh, our main guy. I, I'm going to pop Johnny in the chat. Yeah, absolutely. Lock up and up. I mean, maybe Magic Man was like pointing Faust. out that Orange Cassidy stole his gimmick from uh, Togetsu over there that we were playing as. AEW. Ready, fight. The time has come. Is there like a gunfight happening? In yeah, the we're in the city. <laughs> Do you see how like tough and scary this place is with all this graffiti? Deathless. Deathless clash. Oh, there's a throw. Yeah, punch and grab at the same time. Punch and grab? Or punch and, and, and block. So X and square. Not doing anything. <laughs> it is absolutely X and square. I'll let you do it because you have enough health. Okay. X and square. There it is. Okay. It's it's weird that there's a lot of things that don't have animations unless like the thing is happening. Yes. Uh, that's because this is a uh, badly designed game. Uh, so this is one of your bad ones then. Yes. Not the even though one. I love it. I'd love to see. Oh, there you go. You found your super. Yeah, I see, I've seen it once. I'm happy now. <laughs> Bear in mind, you have a different super if you're not fully charged. That does a little oh. less damage. All right. Are you using a different controller tonight? No. Than usual? Nope, I'm and... using my dual sense. Con oh, you're using a different controller. No, I am using a different controller tonight than usual. And the thing is, I'm having a hard time telling, like, is there something wrong with my controller or this is just the game? No, this is just the game. I'm trying to get my fucking super out, but... Mm. Now, you've played this game far more than I have, I assume, because I've never played it before. Yes. Um, is there... Would you... Do you think there's any meaningful disc from researching characters? No. All right. Some of them might... Their normals might have different, like damage levels, but, you know, they're all roughly equivalent. Supers always do, uh, the, the full charge super always does half health. The fight is in your eyes, too. I don't know if you gathered that or not. Shark's backstory, by the way, God, is that I need, he... Oh, I need, to, I need to run underwater. God, <laughs> I gotta get that out. Shark's backstory is that he once ate a shark, which is why people call him the pirate shark. Or the shark pirates, or king of sharks, or something like that. So that's your character's backstory. There was this a combo breaker. And you know, for all I know, this could have been like a backroom game at combo breaker. Kicked you in the dick a hundred times there. Is there any countering that? I don't think so. <laughs> yeah. You alright? You okay, lady? <laughs> <laughs> oh, taking damage also charges your super, so that's like, you know, sort of like yeah. a comeback mechanic, I guess. There is one other move. Left, yeah, right, one. punch kick. Does what they, I think they call a backbreaker which destroys your guard meter, that blue bar underneath your health. And once you're out of uh -huh. that, I think they actually call that meter your fighting spirit. And I think that makes you less, uh, makes you more susceptible to attacks even as you try to guard and parry. But I do not fully understand how that works. A little bit above my pay grade. Yeah. I know you want to hit me with your super, but... KO. 
<laughs> it's just like I'm hitting I'm hitting buttons. It's the fact that he's just not reacting at all. <laughs> it feels winner. It feels like I'm trying Look at to those like fucking seagulls. By the way, I'm sorry, but looks like they're going nowhere fast <laughs> to me. <laughs> It feels like I'm trying to train a cat. <laughs> well, and that is completely pointless. It's just... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I want to play as Duck King here. Yeah, the, as the description reads, the funky dancing boy. Or something to that effect. Why are we at the port again? Let us select the stage. You fucking game. Ready. Whoa. Okay. Fight. Yeah, literally just Duck King, as Johnny Baghead in, in chat concurs with. <laughs> okay, you found you found a move. So moves exist. I had it, then I lost it. KO. There we go. How did you do that? It's obviously not. It was. I, don't I think have, it was I like quarter move, circle but. and up. So like I don't know like like a half circle but like facing right you know what I mean, and then so, just my kick. Oh okay, so you have you did have to. You have the same fucking move I do. <laughs> so we all everyone has the same moves then. My grab. And again, sometimes he just is like, no, don't feel like it. In fact, very often he's like, I don't feel like it. I would love to get my super out. Oh, no, you got yours out. This might kill me. Time over. Nope, you'll at least you'll get a timer scam on me, though. Yeah. Johnny Baghead said, if you told me this game was made entirely with Fighter Maker, I might believe you. There's one character in particular like, who really embodies that. I feel like Fighter Maker looked better than this. <laughs> KO. Good try. <laughs> You got you got the hang of this game the way I don't. Yeah, I for whatever reason when it comes to these like sh undeniably objectively shitty games, <laughs> I, I, I can for whatever reason my mind can wrap myself around it. All right, I'll be you. We, we haven't seen Lily here, so. So then it tells you she might be slightly based off of Elena from uh, Street Fighter Three. Could be wrong. Ready, fight. And my guy is based on Vulcan's appearance in uh, Battle K Road. Oh my! Oh, that's different for me. She's got moves. I mean, she has a retreating move, which is strange. Oh, this guy doesn't have the forward flip thing, so I guess there's maybe like two or three different types of characters. Yeah. Like, my forward flip instead is that, um, like, retreat. <laughs> what? Ready. what was that pose? Fight. It's from her ice skating days. <laughs> that or capoeira, I don't know. I don't know what style she's necessarily supposed to be. Oh, that was a different looking super move rather than just like well, a rush. All the super moves are kind of unique, like slightly per character. I mean, they all do the same well, exact damage, which makes them, you know, but cosmetically, they, they speak well, to the Mostly what I've seen is them doing like rush downs. Like that one is, is a grapple. That was different, at least. <laughs> Fuck. Well, I think I found my character. Yeah, I think you did. You won't believe who my character is in this game. Winner. Is it the little clown boy? No. Okay. Is he angel or devil? I mean, I would assume that your character was uh, Hands and Pants Man. 
Well, is there anyone we haven't seen yet? Yes, you need to pick Klaus. I need to pick Phantom. All right, where's Klaus? There he is. Your guy is just Kenshiro. Your guy is literally just Kenshiro. He's the guy from the opening demo. It's just Kenshiro. Cemetery. And my guy has to be seen to be fucking believed. His super especially. Ready. Oh, I know this guy. I, I will try to make sure that you actually see your super. Don't worry about it. Let me ask it. you something, because, because again, I'm trying to see if things are just the game or are, um, like, the controller. Does everything feel really delayed? Yes. That is just the game. Here's my super. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> The most fighter maker shit ever. No fighting spirit, bitch. <laughs> like my fighting spirit gauge didn't even drain though. Winner. Wait, no, oh, that round. just ends. It was just. <laughs> it just it just ends the match. I don't even know how I did that. It was like an instant kill or some shit. <laughs> well. <laughs> I think you're gonna win this one. I uh, perhaps. I don't know. I'm half tempted to select Phantom, but you're gonna go with your your character. Oh, is it also L? Yes. Oh, <laughs> that's right. why I said you won't sure. believe who my fucking character is. But you know what? Just for the sake of not getting confused, because I will absolutely get confused as to which L is which. Okay. <laughs> I will go with my backup, who is Kogetsu. <laughs> Back Alley, a perfect place for a final showdown in this game. Is this the level with the, yeah, the guns? Fight. Oh, that's okay. So I no longer know what input does that. <laughs> KO. Ah, okay. <laughs> Good try. Jamada, Misuro. Ready, fight. You got me with it. It's only half your health, though. You still have your super, mind you. Yeah, I know. I have to hit it, though, is the issue. Yep. KO. You got me. <sighs> the secret is to only do it on hit confirm. Is only do it after doing the parry. That is... By the way, before I, I play my graphic, my well-earned fucking graphic for this, for finally mm -hmm. getting a win off, uh... I will say that where I learned about how the super moves work is just a random YouTube video. This game is not documented anywhere online. No one has, like, you know, the inputs or any sort of clue as to how to play this game, except for one YouTube video that is a showcase of all the characters and all their super moves and backbreaker moves or whatever. And so from watching that and watching that person play is how I intuited just, like, what the timing was on these things and the fact that everyone's moves do, like, the same amounts of damage and whatnot. So I, honest to God, like, actually, like, had to learn this game at a certain point in time, which is why I feel somewhat passionately about it, I guess, as much of a uh, piece of hot garbage it may be. Now, that being said, I have earned this. All right, let's go ahead and add one point to my side of the board. And that will be our first game for the night. Uh, five more at least to go. And I believe it is loser's privilege to pick the second game. I don't think that's how that works, but... <laughs> uh, I, need, I need to play something like more traditional. 
after that. Okay. You know, something. Let's uh, play Street Fighter. Oh, Street Fighter. You want to play some Street Fighter? Yeah, the movie. Wait, no, I was... You, oh, you the said... game. Okay. Do you mean the Sega CD one? Like the, the, the Street Fighter, the animation movie, or... No, no, no. Street Fighter, the movie, the game, the arcade experience. Okay, so not the PlayStation version, but the plays like Super Turbo or whatever, but the, the, the arcade original one? Right. The arcade original. Okay. If you say so. Do me a favor, put in some coins. Just keep putting them in. I mean, we're on free play, so we're just giving the arcade operators money oh. at this point. <laughs> I mean, this is also for my enjoyment. <laughs> you ever see this movie? Yes. I actually have not. It's fine. Does it's... this... I'm sorry. Does this Mandarin marshmallow drink have a seed in it? Anything is What is going on with this? Jean-Claude Van Damme. You, of course, know the, the legend that Mortal Kombat was originally meant to be a Jean-Claude Van Damme st starring. Yeah. Turned out uh, Street Fighter got him first. All right. You ready to jump in? Yeah. I'm player okay. two. You're player one. That's fine. We will oh, quick okay. save on this screen. When it comes to arcade games, I don't give a shit who's player one, who's player two. We both have equivalent control. All right. I'm going to see if my Street Fighter 2, Street Fighter 3 Chun-Li knowledge will, will carry me. Chun-Li. Well, one of us is going to have to change. <laughs> Hurricane. Hurricane. I'm surprised they actually left Hadoken and he just didn't say fireball. Hurricane. Hurricane. Hadoken. Hadoken. Now this game is going to have like features that we're not going to be able to take advantage of as much yeah. as I would love to show off like the throw reversal reversal reversal. Like, I, those are, like, some special button inputs that I don't know. Yeah, we're not here presenting ourselves as experts on these games, just enthusiasts. I am going to have to fix my controls. Oh, sure. What's wrong? Uh, everything, basically. This is oh. square. <laughs> tr this is triangle. This uh -huh. is cross. This is circle. This is L1. This is L2. This is R2, R1. So I'm missing. I'm just straight up missing moves. Everything here is just uh, misbound, unfortunately. So I am going to have to do uh, something about that. Uh, all right, that should be medium. No, that should be weak kick. This isn't going to help me in the in the actual game, mind you. This is I, 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 uh, I may have done a little bit of practice across a few of these games. At the very least, like just wanted to make sure that I had them working. Me getting bound in a different slot here is why this uh, I'm thrown off on this one. But uh, yeah, I, I quickly realized that uh, Street Fighter, the movie, the game. Not my game. Uh, not my, uh, not the one for me. Uh, your controls all seemed fine, right? Let me, let me, let me double check. Uh, weak kick, medium kick, weak punch, medium punch, and then where are my heavies? Uh, left bumper, oh. Oh, that's not good for me. Do you, you want that switched around? Uh, so I want R1 to be strong punch, or right bumper to be strong punch, and right trigger to be strong kick. Okay, so strong punch, strong kick. And then I will... And then you don't need uh, the L stuff bound, right? I guess not. I don't know if this game requires you to hit three buttons for a... Uh... It might, so I'll do punch and kick. Three punch, okay. three kick. You get it? Yeah. Okay. Let me... Okay. <laughs> Spinning okay. bird kick. That's good. She has to specify because people kept getting confused about it. What is it? Spinning dog kick? No, no. No, bird. It's... Bird kick. All right. Very good. I'm hoping it doesn't put us on the same level every time. 
It probably will. My favorite uh, Street Fighter character, Blade. Bison's Lair. All right. Okay, there's something I want to show off. And it, here, here's how I think we should do it, right? Oh, you actually countered uh, my... Oh, I did counter, yeah. Let's um, just see what the... Whoever one of us goes on to the next thing, let's just see what the next stage is. Okay. Because I'm really hoping it's the stage with all the televisions. Because I, I have something I want to show. It's like one of the few things I know about this game. Oh my god, I got so close and I still couldn't. Yeah, I thought I was going to lose. Is this a charge character? What is this character's... All I know is I'm playing this the way that people played World Warrior competitively, which is just Hadouken, 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 Hadouken. I forget what the backstory of this character is. It's just something like, I don't know, we had this costume. I think he's just supposed to be, supposed to be just like a, one of the hapless, like, bison goons. Ah, oh, finally get one in. I wonder how to do any of the super moves in this game. Is this double yeah, quarter I circles? I don't see. I don't know if it's that or if it's like uh, triple button inputs, because there is something mapped for triple buttons in the retro arc there. I got stunned. Well, I can tell you it's not the the double button stuff. A triple button. A triple rather, button, but... yeah. Okay, oh, yeah, it's it. double quarter circle. Okay. Okay. John says that is one of the... Uh... Oh, they let me pick a character, too, so this is perfect, actually. Oh, okay. Great. Oh, okay, so while you're on this screen, right? Hit start. That'll happen every time you hit start. <laughs> Very cool. Very good, thank you. And I can change my character every time, so this is perfect, actually. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, I will stay uh, Guile. I'm gonna try Akuma. Akuma, who was not in the movie. Yeah. But, you know, who was, like, a big deal at the time in terms of, like... You know, like, the lore around this character at this point in time was... It was, a, it was like, you know, the closest thing they had to the Mortal Kombat, you know, like, Reptile, that sort of, like, level of secrets. Yeah. Which, it turns out, was a huge fucking selling point in the 90s for magazines that sold secrets. Yeah. Or made up secrets. I know Guile is charged. Man, this... I... Can I this practice stage a move? Sucks. Sure. Okay, one that's second, that's though. the move. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> one second. Let's make sure our health is even before you practice that move. Okay. It should be back towards and punch for your sonic boom. Well, no, it's it's just uh, yeah. I mean, it's a forward charge. Yeah, it's that. Yes, that's what I was saying. But the other move <laughs> I was looking for was. That. It's a good flash kick. Okay. Yeah, because that is like that is the guile move. That is a signature guile move in my mind. That's I one mean, that people uh, always kick my ass with when I play against people who play guile. Because I, mean, I, I feel never like the see a guile coming. move is Sonic Boom. Is voice of Sonic Boom. How would I do a super? Um, the I don't know. Depends on the game. Sometimes it's like hold back as you would charge and then forward back forward. I wonder how you grab. There yeah, we go. A good question. <laughs> That's why I always die to Guile plays. Oh, right. Johnny Baghead said, Johnny's... reportedly the developers didn't even have actual pictures of Akuma's upcoming sprites, so they had the movie's costume designer guess based on a description. Also, Guile is a handcuffs move in this that I can't, I don't know how to do that. So. Uh, Johnny also said earlier that one of the, the Blade is one of the developers in a Shadowloo costume they borrowed to make more characters for the game. Now, describe Sawada. 
Um, Sawada is Ken's best friend from Hollywood who let him crash at his house when he and his wife were on the outs. Is this from the comics? Is that his act? Do the, they actually... I, I'm, I'm making shit up, but okay. <laughs> I don't know who Sawada is. He's probably from the movie. Maybe. I don't know. I've never seen it. I don't think he is. I think the thing about him is that, yeah, Kato Sawada says Black Last Jack. I think the thing is that he's like maybe like a complete like side character in the movie or is not in it at all. But they, they wanted another like martial artist in the mo in, in the game to like have like legitimate chops. For that the like, motion capture sessions. <laughs> Well, whoever he is, he fucking sucks. Uh, Johnny Beckett says, Sawada was reportedly an actor Capcom Japan were pushing hard. Sawada, I believe, is his actual name. Sawada. Oh. So it was just, like, Jackie Chan in Fist of Fire. <laughs> this is Sawada in Street Fighter, the movie, the game. I like that move that I have. Oh, that would would have been good if it hit. Let me see if I can do a super here. Okay, give it a shot. Nope, just didn't work. Well, I'll continue nonetheless. Cammy, played by Kylie Minogue, who was a uh, briefly a pop star, and then her career fell to uh, her career fell to this low. Oh Jesus. Oh, I'm gonna hate this fight. I'm gonna hate this matchup. And also, I don't know any Cammy's specials. Uh, I believe she's a charge character. Like, when you get to these old, uh, like, you know, Street Fighter 2 characters, like, half of them are charge characters. I don't think Cammy's a charge character. I think you're leading me astray. Is she not a charge character? She is not a charge character. Okay. I feel like. The thing is, any old Street Fighter character, if I look at them, I'm like, yeah, they're probably a charge character. Unless they're explicitly a Shoto. No, she's a half-circle character. That's got to be... Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, I was so close to getting a super out. Do Cammy's crouching heavy kick, says Bag. Never skip leg day. I'm not as good at this as you are. <laughs> I have an advancing crouching heavy kick, which is weird. Still haven't quite figured out how uh, kick, throws function. Kick. Yeah, I never know with Street Fighter. I know they change the, the throw command or the grab command every game. Well, she's happy about it. Do we have different win icons based on our affiliations? Yes. Because I have, I have like a Shadowloo yes. thing. Yes. Did, am I, okay, so am I mistaken, or when I was playing as E. Honda, did he also have Shadowloo stuff? He was recruited by Shadowloo in the context of the movie, I believe. That's fucked up. Oh, that feels like it, uh, combos in a real nasty way. I was trying for a super there, but I ultimately determined that, uh, no, just regulars, normals would, uh, would get it done. I, oh, we Vega, also have... Vega and Balrog are the only two we haven't seen. No. No, you're off. I we haven't Ken done Ken, we haven't round. done Vega, we... You, 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 I did Ken first round. Okay, then we also haven't done Honda, we haven't done Balrog, we haven't I did done Honda Bison, the previous we haven't done round. Zangief. We haven't done Zangief. Vega versus Zangief. Round one, fight! Now, Zangief, I know, is a charge character, which means I have no chance. Actually, Zangief has a lot of, like, half-circle, full-circle kind of moves, oh, traditionally. Yeah. Now, Vega is a charge character. Can Vega climb the invisible fence in the background? Oh, I haven't been able to figure that out yet. Uh, 
Yeah, Vega doesn't feel good in this one. Oh, that's that's the famous kick. <laughs> this is actually how they dance in Russia, as I'm led to believe it. Oh my god, how are you not dead? Oh Jesus. Yeah, I don't know. Hi, right, there you are. Okay, so Bison. We Honda, haven't seen Bison Balrog. and Balrog. I don't remember you playing as Honda. I played it. I was literally saying, "Hey, when I was playing as Honda, didn't he have Shadowloo thing up?" Oh, he was, like, he was recruited well, that in the makes movie. sense, I suppose. Oh, Raul, Julia. Last roll, right? Yep. The one he'll be remembered for by most people of a certain age. Wasn't he also Gomez Adams in the movie? Uh, yes. But even that isn't, like, you know. You know, I was gonna tell you, like, an actual, like, famous role he had, but, uh... Couldn't think of any besides these two. <laughs> yeah, I guess that really goes to show that I am, at the end of the day, a person of a certain age as well. Yeah, I don't like playing as him, and that's uh, unfortunate, but I've, I've never been good at... I believe he's a charge character. He is. All right. Time has come. I feel like... I don't usually like Charge characters. I feel like Balrog's pretty good. Just in that little bit I played as him. And I... Gotta stick with my girl Chun-Li. Back where we all, where it all started. Yep. There it comes. Yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah. Wait, no, no, wait, 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 wait. Oh, the ah. jump on the head move is my is my favorite move in, in Street Fighter 2. <laughs> and 3, incidentally. Can wall jump in this? Oh. All right. I game going into this. I don't know how that was a mix-up. was so fucking close. I, well, I was far. trying to figure out what the super would look like, which one of those moves would be like a super, but <sighs> well played, Sharky. That was that was as close yeah. as close can get on this sort of thing. Yep. Well thought. 
All right, let, let's hit your screen. But first, I gotta put my name in, of course. All right, let, let's hit your victory. Mm -hmm. Boy, tied, tied going into the third match. All right, let's see here. I think that means it's my turn again, right? Yes. Okay. I'm going to hit you with one of my good ones. We're going back to the PlayStation. All right. Back to whence we came. A 1997 release. It's Bushido Blade. I love Bushido Blade. I doesn't, that doesn't necessarily mean I'll be good at it. But I'll have fun with it. Uh, I like it in concept. <laughs> let's make sure everything is bound up proper. I definitely rented it uh, as a kid. And was like, what, you only die in one hit? What? Well, that's not always the case, but yes, that is the impression you would get from it at a certain point. Lightweight. But you can't drink for shit. Very stylized, this game, for those who don't know, who weren't around, who did not own PlayStations in the 90s. And like... This game was everywhere. This game was absolutely fucking, like, came out of nowhere in people's minds. Like, in this game took over, like, it had no, almost no right to for what it is. Games like this don't get popular. You know, that's just, that was just like the impression that I, I had even at the time. But at the same time, like, I'm so glad it did. I'm so glad that people were like, were talking about this game and that I could play this game with people because I just thought it was the coolest shit in the world. My, my, you know, preteen anime loving brain was just like, this is the shit. You ever my... play the two player link cable first person Fuck mode? No, no one did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So we have story mode. We have versus mode. Where we'll be spending much of our time today. Slash mode is the like get to a hundred kills mode. Uh, I made sure to do that, so we have the character you unlock from doing that in versus okay. mode. Point of view mode. I don't remember if this has multiplayer or not. I don't think it does. So, uh, as I said, POV mode, like, if in the first person, there is two player for that, but you need a link cable, yeah, two which televisions, is and mode. two copies of Bushido. But, like, yeah, which is link mode then, yeah. Yeah. So, no, no POV. Okay. Yeah, it all checks out then. Uh, so yeah, we're just gonna spend our time in, in versus mode. Then maybe I'll do whoever wins gets to do a mo a round of POV mode for funsies. Sure. Okay, I'm definitely have to learn the controls. It's very exact here. I will take the first round to walk through them. Is that fair? Yeah. Now, granted, I don't remember a lot of the advanced controls as far as like. You know, the equivalence of specials or what have you. Mm hmm. All right, we can choose. Different weapons have different ranges, different attack speeds, so on and so forth. I usually went for the Nodachi. That's kind of what I was looking at, too. But we should both start with katanas, because it's just a sure. good, like, starter. It, it just gives you the impression of, like, how it works. Some characters have weapon-specific moods, by the way. Uh, we'll get there when we get there. Okay. <laughs> we have our selection of arenas here. Let, let's do first one in the Cherry Blossom Grove. Yeah, every character has like a weapon that is like their definitive weapon. All right, so obviously D-pad will move you around. Holding down L1 gives you free running. You can go in any direction. Now, I have raised my sword, and I cannot put it down. R1 seems... is raised stance. R2 is lower stance. Oh, okay. You cannot oh, do I it while moving further. or attacking. You have to be standing still okay. to change stances. 
And obviously what yes. level you have it at will change your moveset. Not only that, but it'll also allow you to deflect certain moves, just naturally speaking. Square is also Sorry. your parry. Okay. For, for deliberately pairing stuff. Otherwise, like, I'm going to attack you. Just stay still. I promise this mm -hmm. will go fine. Because you had your sword okay. up there to, at the same level as I did, you managed to block that. So the game is about jockeying for angle, basically. Now, obviously, triangle is going to be, like, high moves. Um, circles circle mids, is X's mid down. Yeah. yeah. But, you know, it's still a matter of mixing up what stance you're attacking from, knowing which stance, combination of stance and button Here. press does what. Okay, theoretically, because it doesn't look like it should be the case, but if I'm stanced low and you attack low, do I deflect, or is it because my knee is just sticking straight out? So that's okay, the answer yeah. to that one. That doesn't count. We were just testing that. And can I can I test one more thing? Yes. Just come at me if I'm mid. I want to see if I can deflect with, like, parry. Nah, that didn't really... No. I feel like I would get a different Start animation tapping if squares. I was... Yeah. Yeah. Just keep tapping square. Okay. There. You see that? Did you see that green? Oh, that's that's way more generous than I thought it would be. Yeah. That I could just tap it out. You can't always tap well, it out. Well, not so much. But you, you get lucky once there. But yeah, uh, with the perfect timing, you get a green, which means that you can just go yeah. for it. There is one other control. I don't know if it matters at all, but R1 lets you climb up stuff. So R1? Up here. Same as... Yeah. Let's fight somewhere scenic. All right. Ready to go? Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Dude, those big swings really take. There we ah. go. Yep. There's also some throwing weapons. I don't remember the key for that. How is it? Best of two or, or best of three, or is it just one round? It is one round, one life to live. You okay. can rematch it if you want to. Let, let's do two. Let's do best of two with each set of characters. Okay. Or best of three, you know what I mean. Yeah. Yes, there are also running attacks, in case you hadn't. And they're pretty good sometimes, if you yeah. get the right angle on it. Alright, so mash out uh, triangle and, and circle to get past that screen. You have to go it's back right to back here. All right. Yeah. Slash Jack People are trying to point out that stages. you can like yeah. you can run to other stages. That's I think it's only in story mode. I don't I think the stages are closed in multiplayer just to keep the game running at some sort of pace. All right, you got all the controls. I think so. Now don't now see that seems unfair. That's slightly. Well, if this is the fuck around round that I'm gonna go for sledgehammer. Yeah, might as well, right? Horse place says, wait, who the fuck says Bushido Boy is a bad game? No, this is our good game of the night from Cass's Picks. Yeah, we're just picking fighting games here. Not every game on the Bad Game Hall of Fame is a bad game. We just wanted to... We, we played our, some of our bad games for tonight already. Yeah. Alright, bye. Why I oughta... Come here, you. <laughs> yeah, really yeah, ain't much you can like do about was... that one. Yeah. This guy's kind of a shit. So yeah, this is the unlockable character, and he is nowhere near fair. So when it comes time to do the uh, the 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 real match, we should probably ban this guy. Yes. <laughs> Video Game King wants to know if you can deflect bullets with your katana. You might be able to. Well done. 
Oh, I thought you weren't dead yet. <laughs> nope, if you see the red, that means they're dead. Yeah. Okay. And... I want one more. With this guy before you put him on the shelf. Ah. All right, got it. Uh, I didn't even have <laughs> an opportunity. <laughs> Didn't, okay, so didn't Bushido Boy 2 have a gun using character like straight out the gate? You didn't even have to unlock him? I don't remember if you had to unlock him or not. I think he has an M16, though. Real Golgo 13 type. Alright, so that, that, that character is obviously a bit of a joke. Yeah. But, uh. Pax Slash Jack says you have to unlock the two gun characters in Bushido Boy 2. I would be inclined to believe. Yeah, I don't remember which characters specialize in which weapons, which I think is a bit of a problem, actually. Ah. Because we, we are potentially locking ourselves out of, like, their their best moves by, by getting it wrong, you know? Let me try a saber. Louise PSC, I know Black Lotus uses the rapier. Well, yeah, that's the one I remember. Let's do Executioner's Cove. This one's scenic. You know, you know this all takes place in modern day, right? As horse plays pointing yes. out in the chat. Yeah. There's level and story mode, which is just like straight up like a helicopter pad. Oh, well done. Yeah, I think when we do the real one, let's do best of best of five. Okay. Wow. Yeah, I like, just got greedy. One of the most valid strategies in this game, by the way, is to uh, knock your opponent's legs out because you can injure yep. your opponents here. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah, good ah, try. I don't want to fight. If only I knew my fucking how to throw daggers and stuff. Yep. I'm stuck crouching now. That still didn't kill you somehow. Yeah. That'll kill There you me. go. This combination feels all right, as far as I can tell. I don't know if it's uh... Johnny Baggett saying, I always wondered if the jank ass Deadliest Warrior games are trying to replicate this in particular, because it has similar systems. That would not shock or surprise me. Honestly, they could have been cooking. They could have been going for something there. Those games, we had to find some way to get these on stream at some point. Okay. You should play Black Lotus, because I know for a fact what their special weapon is. It's the Rapier. Okay. And I'll be Kanoki. I think I think he's actually a Katana user. Regular ass Katana user, this guy. Yeah. If someone could tell me what uh Who uses the Nodachi? Is who who has like special moves with the Nodachi? Uh, it would be a greatly appreciated for me, for, for my purposes. You want to do Executioner's Cove again? I, I just... Oh, again? Oh, like, whichever. <laughs> yeah, that was the beach one we just did. Is this our match, by the way? No. Okay. Oh, well, you just played this guy, didn't you? Yeah, but I'm going to try out how it's supposed to feel. If it's, like, different. Okay, that's the same thing. Uh, Gimvik Hugh says Mikado and Utsusumi. Or Utsusumi are the Nodachi guys. Okay, good. So as long as I pick one of those two with a uh, 
Nodachi, I'll be fine, probably. I think I might pick the other one for uh, Nodachi, because I kind of liked it. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> Did we miss any characters? Not that it fucking matters. The, the, the characters I I, aren't really a thing here. It's the weapons. And I guess it's a combination of weapons think we and characters. Did. Yeah, I like using the Nodachi better. All right. Then for the sake of... I might go with someone with a Katana then. Because I might be able to counter Nodachi with Katana a little better if I have a little bit more speed. This could go either way, of course. Yeah. That's always the risk. All right, Those. so you would want either Utsumi or uh, Mikado. You know, I don't think we've seen Utsumi, so I'll go... Yeah, you might as well. Yeah. I will go Red Shadow. Or saying Tatsumi is the Katana guy. Who's, who's Katana, then? I think Red Shadow is Katana. I'm fairly certain Katana is like her default weapon that she's meant to use. The horse play says Tatsumi. I don't want to play as this fucking dweeb. <laughs> okay, you can play as Red Shadow. Also, I think Tatsume is Utsume's son. So, you know, we'd have some father-son. Also, back pointing out that I wish there was a way to use the single-player costumes versus... Yeah, every character has different costumes. You can't select between them. You also can't, like, have two people playing the same character to see them. It's very strange the way they handle the alternate costumes in this. Which is to say that they're they're forced by game mode. Uh, fuck, I'm just gonna do Red Shadow with Katana and we'll see what happens. Okay. Alright, this is the one? Best of five? Yeah. Let's do it in, uh... The beach is scenic, but let's, let's... Do you want to do it in the bamboo thicket or the cherry blossom grove? Uh, cherry blossom grove. I feel like there's better visibility there. Oh, Black Glass Jack says Mekyoyan. Or Yokan. Which I think this is, like, the uh, the dojo. Maybe. So this, is, this could be a good one, too. Okay. All right. Okay. All right, that's one. Hmm. Oh, damn it. My, my block right. didn't come out with my sword behind one to my one. back. Yep. What about uh, first to three is what we're playing to, right? Yeah. Is what best of five effectively means? Yeah, okay. Yes. All right, I'm ready. Horse placing, since you're not going to play him, Tatsume dual wields katanas. Ah. That figures. Maybe I should have gone with that. Well done. All right. Tie game. This would be a great time to fight dirty with my throwing weapons or kicking dirt or whatever. Okay. Oh, I got too greedy. Oof. 
I tried to bait it. I tried to bait the attack and then like, but I didn't expect it to actually like turn around and parry it. I didn't expect my character to block it from behind. Yeah. Well played. And that's that. Uh, let's let's get back to menu. No, I so I'm gonna hit the victory screen. I'll, I'll up you by a point, but then I want you to play some uh, POV mode. Gotcha. The dirty play is R1, then O while crouching. Says horseplay. Thank you. So that's, that's something you can potentially do when you uh, assume control here. All right, please go into POV mode, and I will get your. Yeah, so do, do me a favor, do Tatsume, do Katanas. Okay. Now you select your uh, AI opponent. Whoever you want to beat up on. Fuck you, Dad! Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah, keep Katanas. And hopefully you have like two a special option. The CV has two of them, yeah. Okay. Oh, I have to pick his too. Yeah, he can have whatever. Uh... Yeah, sure. Uh, do the bamboo thicket. Do it for Bag, because Bag wants to see you cut down some of the bamboo, which you can do. Now, this might go very poorly. Oh, possibly. That's okay, Nopla knows you only have one katana, so... Got his ass. <laughs> now that's Bushido, right? I believe so. Like, killing him and then slashing him again and then waiting until he's on the ground and then slashing him again. Put him out of his misery. You're saying it's one of the stances, but I didn't look like any of the stances were two katanas. It's a separate stance, says Backlash Jack. Uh, yeah, so uh, keep pressing like R2 or R1. <laughs> Well, I was. Yeah. Randy, it's hard to tell in first person mode, but no, it doesn't seem like it. Or maybe it's some obtuse combination of buttons to activate that special stance. Which, you know, unless you tell us what that is, we don't know. Like, you know, that, that's the thing about this format is that we're not necessarily like going in with like all the domain knowledge in the world. Yeah. You know, we're just here for a good oh. time, not like an expert's time. Front direction in R2, they're claiming. I don't know if that's true, though. This this feels like something you would have read in a magazine until I see it happen. Did you try to run me through with a sledgehammer? Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> All right, have you POV'd yourself out? I think I think I'm I think my V has been thoroughly peed. People now contend that it's probably just in P uh, P, uh Bushido Blade 2. And it's, okay, you can stop trying to give us button combinations yeah. here because clearly it's not like we, we need to move on. Try the game yourself and yeah, find out what that's like. Consider playing is. Bushido Blade for yourself. Right, now, that was my if we pick. may, yeah. before my next pick, if we can take a brief intermission. Uh, go back to our respective corners. Talk to our coaches. Get to get some feedback. Spin into a bucket, advice. whatever they do. <laughs> All right, I reckon we can do that. Uh, we'll be back in just a couple short minutes, folks. Just don't go anywhere.
And we're back. And I kind of want to mess with something here. A previous prediction, or named a prediction, who will win? Uh, Cass or Shark? Or let's do Cassidy and Shark, because these are proper names. Uh, we'll give folks five minutes to, to, uh, to wager. Now, is this for the whole kid and caboodle for all of tonight? For all of tonight. Who will win the night? I'll, I'll even specify in the... Uh, a streamer or mod willing to confirm the outcome within 24 hours of the end. Okay, great. Got it. Prediction started. I, I still have no idea how most of this uh, Twitch stuff works. Uh, so, <laughs> we, uh, you let us know if we did it right, I guess. And, and I believe it is your game to pick, Sharky. All right. <clears throat> so, um, I think my next thing I want is the Fallen Angels. The Fallen Angels, the, the origin of your uh, windscreen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is a 1998 arcade game uh, developed by Steelheart, published by Psycho. Uh, this game was released unfinished, like to the extent that there are just characters, like you know, with sprites sitting around on the uh, on the ROM that just aren't implemented, that can't be like unlocked or anything. So uh, uh, the game director, if I remember correctly, the game director and artist went on to SNK after this, and one of the first games they worked on was King of Fighters '99. And you might see some King of Fighters 99 similarities in this game. The earthquake that struck the city at 7.13 a.m. on February 10th, 2007 on the Richter scale. The veneer piece that had been maintained in the city streets. All right, so Japan, uh, the, the big earthquake hits Japan, and there's this region called Eden, the last paradise. The year is 2010, and uh, Eden is separate from the rest of the world, basically. An attractment with no sound. Very cool. Okay. Right. Uh, by now the way, our mechanic. Go on. Uh, Ten points have been wagered on me. Fourteen thousand have been wagered on you. Oh. A minute. So uh, I, I see where the wind is blowing. Are you ready? I'm ready. So I was about to say, there are mechanics in this game. There's stuff like a dodge. There's like a power charge kind of thing. I don't really know how to do them. I'm player one. All right, I'm going to quick save on this screen. Okay. Now, I'm going to start with Cool. I'm going to start with you again. I, cool is not a character I'm good with. He's a charge character, but uh, fucking like how he looks. Because he is just... K-Dash. This game is animated this... to hell. Yeah, this game is fucking cool. I think I am missing buttons. Uh, four button game, right? I, I thought it was a six button game, but I'm not I'm sure. I'm thinking it's four. Because I have all my buttons that I'm aware of. Let's just double check. It's been a little bit since I played this one. Oh, yeah, that's the wrong menu. Uh, oh, yeah. Con wait, where are the con fucking controls? Oh, there they are. Yeah, four button game. Okay. All right. Yep. Yeah, I just missed All your buttons are bound. Let me make sure mine are too. Yep. <laughs> Damn. Stop blocking my super. Oh, come on. You should have given me that. That one was on you. 
Uh, how do I even exist? Says speaking of unreleased fighters, y'all uh, did y'all do or are gonna do tattoo assassins? Did we do tattoo assassins yet? We did not. We have not done that yet. We will do it. it everything will come in time. Fight. Oh come on. <laughs> I was trying to do that cool move I was doing where I was jumping across the screen. Uh, oh, well, you, you, you caught me with the first hit of it. Yep. Well done. This game feels all right. I know some people don't like how it feels, but, and I can understand it. I like it being a little heavy. You know how to grab by any chance? Not really. I found really. how to taunt. Oh, I found how to dodge too. Yep. There is actually a stance change, which is, um, oh, which I don't really know how to do. It's different combinations of two buttons at a time do different things. Yeah. There you fucking right, go. You, you for real caught me with that one. I hit up when I didn't mean to. That'll happen. See our win quote. Not so friendly, but a nice guy. Let's see, does it but us, us both the same stage? No. no, you're stuck on. Okay, so go ahead and load the state. Yeah, we'll see if it puts us on, on a different stage. Well, I'll I don't be think it will. The sister of the character I just played as, I'll be Yurian. Or no, that's Yurian. This is Yuri Ran. Yeah, this figures. This is actually a ruined version of that stage, though. Like, pre-ruined. Did all the damage for us. Ooh. Yeah, this character is slow, but, like, his moves are, like, beefy. A beefy boy, if you will. Ah. Oh, I don't even know how I did that, yeah. but I'm happy. Your character, your character's a grappler. Oh, good. I do like grapplers. Almost as much as I like rushdown characters. Unfortunately, I can't figure out how to do a single one of her specials, so... Let alone her supers. Uh, Backlash Jack saying, Charky's character appears to just be Maxima from uh, King of Fighters. No, there's another character who is just Maxima from King of Fighters. We'll, we will see him. Johnny Bag. Oh, oh, Sid says that they can see how sex is ruling all the streets in this setting, which was part of the description. Yeah. Uh, this bar was destroyed by all the sex. Hmm. Oh, you're in. I, I wanted to like you, but I couldn't figure out any of your fucking moves. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. I, I didn't mean to skip past that. Why don't you stay home and cook? Yeah, okay, fuck this guy. All right, get your ass. Uh, wait, hold on. Oh, you need to win this, don't you? Possibly. Yeah, I want to get to another you stage. Might just be... So, I'll give you a practice round here. 
So be be aware of that. <laughs> aware of what? Uh, that I have a move that just deletes life. Seems the ending. Jesus wept. Is that one? Cool suplex, though. All right, there we go. You need more than just technique. Get a load of this fucking guy, the stinky fighter. Uh, All right, speed running losing. Quotes. Okay, Gal Wincoat's video uh, on this game referred to him as what Ryu would be like in real life. <laughs> Let's see what he has to say. That's karate. Study the basics. So now I continue. And then I get to choose a new character, hopefully. Yep. Yes. I know who I'm picking. Hairiness. Yep. I'll pick your her. hairiness. So hairiness. This is Maxima. <laughs> By the way, if you see under your name those, like, rockets, yeah. that is a unique resource that you have that you can spend on moves. I don't know if you can reload them or not, but... Yeah. Ow. Gun beats karate every time. At least I'd like to convince myself. Ah, close. Very cool. Horseplay says you cannot reload. That's, That's fine. Oh, I think I win. Maybe. If not, close. I got pretty damn close. Alright, you got that round. I think I like this guy. Master, come to your senses. Wait, this is my master? Yeah. Did he teach me how to use guns? Alright, let me win this real quick. We can get another stage. Get my practice round in. Bam, bam. Thank you, ma'am. So now you're out of missiles for this round. That's fine. He still has other moves, you would think. So you see the issue now. <laughs> well, he still does damage. It's not as much as he Ooh, could Ooh, you're lucky I don't have my missiles, because mm, I would have hit you right here with them and... That kick is pretty cool. I believe I can get that super to come out again. I button mashed to get it to come out the first time. Horseplay also points out that the um, super uses all of your missiles, so I'm not sure how well it would work if you don't have missiles to begin with. We'll find out. Well, no missiles, but just get a hit on them and you got it. All right, let's see. I'm pretty sure you killed him just by saying bang. <laughs> Ruccio Roch. All right, now I see the speedrun dying. Come on, buddy. <laughs> he's a he, look. He's a lover, not a fighter. <laughs> we'll make this our arena. Well, this will be the last time we do this, and this weekend. All right. This graveyard, a cemetery, is a fitting place for our fights. All right, hit start. Well, if okay. Okay. 
have not seen Rush and we have not seen Taro. All right, I'll be Rush. Which one do you want to You be Taro. Okay. And then we got to pick who our our go tos are. We got to pick our. Yeah, I know who my go to is. Oh, I fucked up the timing on mine. I guess I know what the combo is now. It's so easy to get super meter back in this game because it really is yeah. about like you know rewarding aggression. Oh come on! <laughs> what do you think made this guy green? Was it the drugs or the sex? Uh, definitely the sex. See the blue ball move right. You mix that with yellow, and then you get green. That's what you had jaundice to begin with. Yeah. <laughs> God, that's such a weird looking combo. Oh, no. Beans. Oh, you might still get it, though. I didn't capitalize very well. <laughs> I see the one person in chat who, who voted for me, by the way. How do I even exist? I promise. I'm bringing this one home for you. You're a little too old for this. Says you. That, he, he was fighting a little kid. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's time? Yeah. Going with Hajiz. I want to go. My heart tells me to go with Urian. Oh, then the timer told me I go. I'm going with Urian yep. too. Despite Harry seeming pretty cool, I don't want to be left without my bullets. Ay ay ay. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I told. I warned you. I specifically said, hey, watch out, because this character just deletes life. <laughs> Fuck. I thought I could, like, knock you out of it. <laughs> Super armor. Ugh. Need more than just technique. That's why this is my windscreen game. <laughs> Speaking of... <laughs> brutal, Sharky. Just brutal. But I think horse I'm going to get you I guess you, Horse places, I guess you already talked about. Cool and how he's just cape dash. Yep. Hermia saying cast sounds so disgusted. Yeah, you're goddamn right. <laughs> I mean, of course, I'm also a by any means necessary kind of player, so I really can't knock the hustle so much. Uh, for my next game, we are going with another game that was released unfinished. So we're keeping it thematically consistent. So this one was a 2006 game, a, uh, Atomus Wave game. Oh, wait, was it the Atomus Wave? Yeah, I think, well, whichever it is, maybe it's Sega Naomi Heart. It's Jingi Storm, the arcade. Uh, released 2006, developed by Atravia, and uh, published by Atravia. I think this is a Thomas Wave. I could be wrong. Let me let me look at my description for it. Let me make sure I'm not telling tales out of school here. I know it runs in Flycast. So it could be Sega Naomi GD ROM hardware. It could be a Thomas Wave. It could be, it could be anything. All I know is that I discovered this game randomly on Fightcade. Shoutouts to Miles. Uh, Shoutouts to uh, Miles, who I played this with. And I was like, oh, there's something to this. It's a virtual fighter like. Oh, and this is uh, a game. I am all about it. I had not those. heard of until you showed it to me. Let's see what the splash screens say. 
It says Naomi, so it might just be Naomi. Honestly, I could have been wrong about the Atomus Wave. I get that shit confused all the time. All that weird arcade hardware that is effectively just Dreamcasts. Strange that it happened more than once. Atrativa. Get a load of this intro. I don't know if I've ever sat through and watched this. Uh, eight. No oh, God, I'm, wait. Oh. Were the other the names are just... Uh, uh huh. Mm hmm. You're getting real Mugen v uh, vibes. Well, we have set the free play, so uh, do me a favor, hit start. Okay. The Doctor. loudest select sound in the world. Are you sure about that? We still got another game to play tonight. That's true. Okay. These <laughs> three on the right are secret characters. Okay. I'm gonna. I, I won't start with so a secret character. Pick one of right. these Jamooks first. I'll be I, I got us. Uh, I don't know which one. I, I'll go with this one. This guy and the uh, the butler seemed real. Uh -huh. So each of these I'm characters sorry. is accompanied by a girl whose purpose is to look pretty on the intermission screens or on the win and lose okay. screens. So buttons. Punch. Three of them. Kick, guard, guard punch. Kick. Oh, I don't like where those buttons are, but okay. Okay, we can change that. What do you want? Okay, uh, I want triangle to be my kick. Oh, that's so disgusting. Uh, what button is it currently your kick? Uh, circle. It's my kick. All right, then I did it right. What do you want circle to be? I mean, it's a three-button game, right? Yeah. So nothing. It's fine. Okay. Punch and punch and guard are in good places. All right, then. And for my end, I want to maybe flip these two around, and then I'll be happy. All right, let me just. Okay, I'm good. Grab is punch and uh, guard. Okay. Kicking guard is something. All right. You can tell you're doing a special because there'll be like lighting effects next to it. Gotcha. Ooh. That's a throw. It's a camera angle. Okay, I like this guy so far. I, oh, I noticed the default is uh, best of five. Yeah, for multiplayer it is. So you said this was unfinished. Is it unreleased or it's just It's released, but released unfinished, exclusively in Japan. <laughs> yeah, I picked the wrong character to start with. But you will see when you inevitably win this round what the, the girls exist for. Okay. I feel like they should have been assists, right? Yeah. Like you can call them out or something. Or you're gonna press a button combination, their picture would appear on the screen, and they'd say something, and then you'd get like a... Oh wait, no, know, like... do, you, do we not get to see it? Strange, let, let, let's see. Let's let it play out. Yeah, now you okay. Oh, no. so it just kicks you into the uh, fucking. Do you want me to try and beat this guy and so we can see it? Yes, please. Okay. Get a load of this fucking guy. By the way, he's from yeah, France, was... you see. I, I was thinking of playing as him. Yeah, he's apparently the worst character in the game. Oh, okay. No, so there's only two rounds. I didn't. Round two. Fight! Also, notice how your guy is always smiling. <laughs> You know, he's happy to be here. I might I might just want to go through the single player just for us, like, intermittently just to show the characters and each of their lady companions. So maybe I'll restart after this, after you beat this guy's ass. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, so each of the ladies that are meant to accompany these characters will say something, like, on behalf of their client, as it were. 
or, or who they uh, who who accompanies them. All right, I reset it because I want to just quickly boot into. I, w I was thinking it was more like after he beats an opponent, the curse is lifted for a moment, <laughs> and they become to their true self. <laughs> and... <laughs> That'd be more fun for me, but uh, alas. Wait, okay. no, no, why do you press? No, motherfucker, I oh, told sorry. you specifically. Okay. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. It's fine. <laughs> I'm also going to take control. I was, I no. went back to look at chat for a sec, so I might have blanked out. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> fast forward past these. All right, don't uh, press anything. Gotcha. All right, there's Arashi. Anyway. Chad, Dr. Daro, Paolo, Yichi, Ryuya, Shupri, Landy, Gamon, Fenrir, Asuka, and Noel, who's an idol, I believe. All right, you can press start now. Okay. I'm going to be my girl, Fenrir. I am going to be the small child. Go for it. I'm going to say that we can select these characters if so long as, you know, as long as they're all available, as long as you can freely choose between them, between the three of them. They aren't even like the boss characters. They're sub boss characters. I'm disappointed. Fight. I'm disappointed that my character is not shaped like a mascot at a theme park. All oh, right, the controls are going to be messed up, aren't they? Oh, yeah, you're right. Because I, I switched our slots. Sorry, folks. This is how the magic gets made, though. This is, this is uh, an important part of the business here. Button three. So kick is circle and triangle. Punch is square. Block is X for you. Is that okay. good? Sure. Let me okay. just double check. Hit. Eh, yeah. Okay, good. Now, are the secret characters, like, any more powerful or something? No, I don't think they are. I think the bosses would be, theoretically. I really like the way Fenrir plays, is the thing. Not that it's doing me any good here. I mean, I feel like it's doing your print, print, but plenty good. I mean, that was just momentum. Whoa! Okay, these characters might be a little overpowered. Ay, ay, ay! What did you even do, Sharky? <laughs> I, I don't know, but I deleted half your life. Uh, so, I'm thinking maybe we don't to these characters for for the playthrough. <laughs> I've even so far. This girl kind of feels a little bit like a Sarah Bryant type, which is, I think, why I like her. Yeah, it helped me get one, which is nice. Yeah. I don't think I like these secret characters as part of the round, though. <laughs> Do me a favor, press start. Chad, plug ugly. Uh, I did press start. Oh, yeah. okay. I want to see if it lets me change character. No. Okay. All right, so... Now, since you loaded the state, did that screw anything up? You have to press start. We should be all fine, though. So we've done Landy. Done Gichi. I'll be oh. Arashi. Alright, I kind of... You know what? I kind of want to see Dr. Garo. Or hey, Hiromi like and Rukmini. Round one. Fight! Oh. 
I will say, like, no two characters in the game look like they're from the same video game, which is a bit of a problem. That's because this game was built off the scraps of a game that was, like, in development, cancelled, and then repurposed into this. And then not finished beyond that. So, you know. The game's been through the ringer a little bit. Ooh, what? That was one of your specials, uh, what, what? yeah. I don't know how you did it, but it's one of your specials. Actually, maybe every character just deletes life. <laughs> yeah. This guy fucking sucks. Can I just say? You know, what you know, really sucks is that, like, the one game I feel like I'm actually, like, good at is, like, Virtual Fighter 2 and 5, specifically. You know, like, Virtual Fighter likes. Mm -hmm. So the fact that you're whipping my ass in a Virtual Fighter like is, is filling me with, like, an existential dread. Yeah, I'm okay. So, to be fair, I'm bad at actual Virtual Fighter. So, maybe if we get to that someday. It's start again for me. <laughs> I'll be Chad. The Ria. Or Reka. Christine Reka. Reka looking like that one girl from, uh, what's that series? The, the... Round one. I, I've already forgotten what she looks like, so... Purple hair, glasses. How many animes are you naming right now? No, it's like a game series. Soccer Wars? Oh. oh, I've never played Soccer Wars. Or, I have very... I even have very little cultural awareness of Soccer Wars, so... Oh, oh. Oh, you know what? I think might have been the thing when I was playing as Noel and I just took most of your life. I think I might have like clocked you on the head or something. And that did like way more damage. Because it did a similar effect to my last hit to you there. The video game King tell me the girl I'm thinking of is Koran Lee. That's good to know. That was a cool move. My move wasn't as cool. Wow! <laughs> Where did that come from? Insult to injury, come on. I got me. This guy's all right. You know, for being what's that dude from Virtual Fighter, Jeffrey McWild? Uh, Jeffrey was the the. Uh... Oh no, I'm thinking of Wolf. Wolf was the professional wrestler. Yeah. I don't remember Jeffrey being real flippy-dippy, though. I know, but, like, the stance here. The fighting stance where he's, like, dancing oh, okay. in place. I think he does capoeira in, in that game. I don't know what Chad here is doing, but... All right. Oof. Turn that one around. You know, a finished game would probably have voice acted lines for some of this stuff for some of the guy characters, mm. as opposed to just the I lead mean, characters. A, a lot of them, a lot of games don't. But all right, so there's Gamon and there's Asuka. Would you like to be Asuka or would you like to be Gamon? Which one's Gamon? Oh. Uh, I'll be Asuka. Okay. You took too long to decide. <laughs> uh, Asuka's her own best friend. Yes, the, the female characters have no female accompaniment. Round one. Fight. It'd be too powerful if they did. And oh, of course, this girl's like, uh, what's her name for Virtua Fighter? The grappler, the, the lady grappler from Virtua Fighter. I think her name mm -hmm. might be I, which is funny because your partner's name is I. Yeah. Or Aoi. Can't remember. I'm not super deep on, like, Virtua Fighter characters. Neither am I. I should get deep into it. Because that is, like, the fighting game that I, I... The first fighting game I played that I really liked was, was VF2. Which then I, I really got the final showdown. In... 
I have tried to get into Virtual Fighter 5 many different times through like all the different versions they've released of that game, but uh, never stuck. Yeah, there might be something to these these lady characters definitely being stronger than the typical lot. Yeah, that's that's the impression I'm getting. It's great in the story mode too, or the arcade mode as it were, because you get up to like the sub bosses and you pick which of the three girls you want to fight. You pick your sub boss, basically. And you beat them, then you immediately go to the, the final two bosses. Who are the final bosses of this game? Ah, uh, some fucking guy, like some mad scientist guy, then he morphs into a creation of some sort. And that, that creation is like fucking bullshit to fight. The mad scientist guy, not so much. Grabs are good. Okay. All right, we've now seen everybody. We have not seen a lot of the stages in this game, unfortunately, but yeah. uh, I wonder if I can bring That's it to another idea. stage. Let me let me see if I can get it to another stage at least. Let me see if I can get it off this bus station. Just so there's at least a change of scenery. Ay ay ay, Chad! Come on. But you're gonna have to reset anyway, right? Because no, it's. Wait, no, I will. Because when I die, yeah, I... or no, when I continue, I think I get select character. Oh, okay. Jeez, it's a good thing I only need to run two rounds. I could just do this, really. Very good. Hey, we can get another one of these. Very no, cool. She's not your person, but... No, but the enemy's person. They're basically like, hey, congratulations on defeating my guy. All right, I guess we'll do it here. Fight. Wait, did, any, did either of us like, play as Paolo? Oh, I don't think so. Well, I guess the CPU will show him off then. Yeah. Show getting his ass kicked. Oh, because you know what? Because we also didn't... None of us played as the butler guy because we saw him already in that one match. <laughs> Weren't you trying to lose? Uh, I want to see another stage. I want to see a different stage. Okay. This stage does not strike me as final encounter coded. Go. And that's why I kind of just like this game, so I'm getting a couple extra rounds in while I can. I like it a little less if you beat me in it. <laughs> if you take this game away from me. Eh, no, no thanks. Oh, I don't want to see this one either. Truth be told, I, I, do, I do not care to see... Alright, good. Well, I'll get my ass kicked in here then. Come on, come on. Kick my ass. Kick my ass, please. Kick my ass, please. Kick hers. All right, very good. Continue. I actually walked away for a moment so I didn't see what you were like, nope, about. That's good. Wait, they don't let me select character. Oh, for fuck, fuck off, game. Come on. Okay, whatever, fine. We're just gonna do it on the basic stage. We're gonna do it on the default stage. All right. We're gonna pick a not lady choice? character. All right. I knew what those two words meant. Two of you guys get set. Round one. Fight. All right. May the better man win. Ooh, force lightning. Do it. I've got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> Yeah. 
Just trading blows. Ow. <laughs> Ooh. All right. Round three. Fight. Ow. Ow. You know what? I had a moment or forgot which character I was. <laughs> uh, can you forget again real quick for my sake? All right. Round four. Well, it always comes down to the wire with us. Yeah. I was close. <laughs> I'm so disappointed right now. I, I am like so dejected. How do I even exist? I'm so sorry. I know you're the only person who vote. And granted, you only voted 10 fucking points on me versus the 14,000 <laughs> that came in for Charky or whatever. But, uh, you know. <laughs> Well, I guess I'll play your fucking screen. Sharky. Oh, just, for, me to, just to, for fun. To, I, no, we'll go on to one more, but remind me never to bring a game I actually like on the show again. Because you're going to make me hate it. Okay. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> hey, Sharky, what the fuck you want to play last? Um... <laughs> Well, you said the previous game had the loudest select noise. Uh, I beg to differ. I want to play Air Guys God Bless the Ring. You mean Air Guys God Bless the Ring released in 1999, developed by Dream Factory, published by Squaresoft? That's the one. Pro Circuit 92 saying, Cassie, don't give up. There's, we play six games in a night. Turkey has four. <laughs> it's, it's over. <laughs> yeah, this one's just the unwind. <laughs> Ah, oh, there's nothing on the line. God, I couldn't, I couldn't say that with a straight face. <laughs> I, I said I wasn't going to say what the bad games were, but I, I hate this game. <laughs> By the way, everyone, enjoy your channel points. Those of you who participated. <laughs> mm. Gotta watch the cinema, though. Yeah. I like this game. I, I beat the quest mode at some point in my life when I had a lot of mode. free time. The quest mode, conceptually, is really cool. I'll see, ready for a cast of characters that looks like uh, Tekken Rejects. Well, dude, that was their fault for flying it so damn close to the ground. <laughs> I know that sound effect. I know that scream. <laughs> All right, cat, now you get in the leg. This shit's always so hype. 
go back to class. <laughs> God bless this ring of mine. So, you know at the end of arcade mode where you have to fight that fucker over the credits? Yes. How good are you at doing that? Uh, I can I, never do it. I can do it without dying. I don't know if I can always consistently beat him. Okay, okay, all right. So before we do anything... Get the controls. Yeah, let's, let's get the controls, first of all. Put myself in control here. All right, so I know I need to go to the memory card real quick. Okay. To load my data so we have all the characters for arcade mode. So just mm -hmm. uh, give me a second here. All right, there we go. Are you saying anything? I can't hear you after that. It's. I hope that's actually turned up enough for the audience to get, get across how loud that is. <laughs> I mean, we have a limiter in place. We have a, a, a minus 20 decibel limiter, so it's really not going to be the full effect of it. So that's that the helps. best I can do for you, is just stacking sounds on top of each other. Brand new quest, The Forsaken Dungeon. God bless the ring. There's even a couple mini games here. It's out of my system for now. Make sure the options are all default too, because I did download let this me, game, the save file off the internet. To let get me all the check unlocks. The, see the buttons too. That's yeah, an option. Is there an option to see the buttons? No. Okay. No. You have to intuit it. I believe it's four attack buttons, and the shoulder buttons do like a lock on and jump. That's that's how it a, should work. It has been a while. Oh, you can also select right. different uh, controller schemes. Wait, how am I player two? Yeah, how are you player two? I deliberately... Fuck it, whatever. Oh, well. <laughs> so here's all the unlockable characters. Let's start with this, all the characters. God Hand, Lee Shuen, Dasher Inoba, Sasuke, he's really cool, uh, Prince Doza, Yo-Yo Yoko, Joe, Cloud Strife, Tifa Lockhart, Jengo, Sephiroth, Koji Masuda, Claire Andrews. These two characters are from the uh, quest mode. You unlock them. Yuffie Kisaragi, Vincent Valentine, Zack, Han Dehan. Who are going to go with to start with? I'll go with God Hand, whose name uh, Johnny Baggett is pointing out is literally Ken Mishima. So, you know, Tekken. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna. I say we leave HP at default. Yeah. Don't fuck with it. Uh. Just, yeah. Let's okay. Start with the dome. Okay. Ready. All right. I'll let you figure out right, controls. Me, yeah. So it's free run by default. Kick. R1 is lock on, which I think also okay. alters your move set. R2 is crouch, which also alters your move set. Okay. L2 is jump. and L1 are both jump. Triangle and puncher. Punch, uh, triangle and square are punches. Oh, I, I press circle and that's just apparently... Yeah, circle is your range. Yeah. Alright. Alright. This game controls very strangely for a fighting yes. game, even for a 3D fighting game. I don't hate it, but it definitely takes getting used to. You also get used to the, have to get used to the fact that if you whiff, punishes are so real in this game. That every attack has startup and recovery. Remember what R2 does again? Crouch. Okay. Wait, I want to see... Hold on, I want to see something. I'm not going to attack you for a range move. 
I can't I can't get her to do it now because there's some move she was doing that was like just this really weird backward yeah that that's it feels like some bone is breaking when she does that move. It's cool though. That flip. I feel like I got punished on hit there. Oh, this is handy. We can just select our characters from here. And we can make the sound from here. You'll be Vincent, and in that case, yeah. I'll counter you with uh, Sephiroth. Now, I think Django has, like, a skin option that lets him be Red 13. Possibly. I seem to remember that. This basically just makes him red. Which is fucked up because Joe also transforms into a Red 13 looking character with her circle move. We'll see when we get there. How do I make my sword actually attack? I, I never played as Sephiroth. I, I oh, there we go. Remember. There's no real guard, is there? No. You can attack off the walls. If you do it correctly, which I'm bad at. Good enough is. I feel like most people buying this game were doing it because it had Final Fantasy characters in it. Yes. That's what Square marketed this home version of. Obviously, the arcade version did not have all these uh, Final Fantasies in it. God, Sephiroth sucks. No wonder he loses in Final Fantasy VII. Bywood also saying this game centers on grappling, which I don't know how to grab in this, which is going to be a bit of a problem. I'm going to be Joe. I'll be Doza. I don't remember what Doza looks like, but I'll just be Doza. We'll fight on an airship. At some point, I want to see Cloud versus Zack. Ready, go! And look at this. No eyes textured on. This model actually really sucks if you look at it. I was letting people <laughs> look at it. Can I get so close to the camera? No, no facial features whatsoever. But, uh, you know, it's an idea to have her transform to have a beastly form. It's a bloody roar type. Yeah, I really don't remember how to do grapples in this. Neither do I. And I'm one who apparently likes this game. Ow. I kind of actually hate this character select from in the game here. What can you do? I'll be Django. Django! I'll be Django! Yuffie. I've never seen a movie with Django in the title. I've seen dozens of movies with Django in the title in all my spaghetti western watching. Plywood says, I believe it's the shoulder buttons with the face buttons. No, because the shoulder buttons are like lock on and crouch. And those don't really modify any of my moves to be grapples. I was saying they speed ran this game, but they don't grapple in the run. Yeah, that parses. <laughs> oh my god, look at his little paws. Look at his little... Hey! I do your little dance and get a treat. <laughs> the Django. I will kill you. Oh, they're so cute! Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> I call this one the uh, covering my kitty litter. Yeah. Man, he's real low to the ground. <laughs> we'll ban him from. Claire. Mr. Taco uh, I redeemed a highlight message to say that Air Geese and Fighting Eyes came out in the same day in Japan. Would that be December 17th? I think. I think it's when Fighting Eyes came out, so. You ready? Yeah. I don't remember who I picked. Ready? All right, Claire. Uh, Claire. Oh, I almost had a throw. Why am I jumping automatically? Don't ask me. Oh, this isn't a controller dying thing, is it? <laughs> Already had that happen once. I still can't believe I lost in fucking Jingy Storm, the game I brought here specifically as my ringer game. Uh, Video Game says we need to play the uh, Cloud versus Sack match on this stage. Sure. It's because it's canon. I'll be honest, Air Guys was my anti ringer game. <laughs> the one that you knew you were going to lose at? Yeah. All right. Where the Wait. fuck is Zach? Do we have to go back to the main thing? To pick Zach? Maybe. Wait, hold on. Get off a cloud for a second. I want to see something. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, they forgot to add him to here. Strange. Uh, let's go to exit the title then, yeah. I guess. Mega Driver saying, also, God, I went to drink for a bit and Sharky's up to th up by three. Cassie need to smoke some serious weed. I don't know if that'll help. I don't know if that will necessarily be the cure. Also, I already lost. You can't come up from... Me? Gongaga. I still have not played, uh, what do you call it? Crisis Core. Keep meaning to. You're fine. Ready. I mean, I don't need to play any game, but... Yeah, I was curious if we had any different moves or if this is straight up mirror. I mean, it's gonna be straight up mirror because these characters are mirrors. Yeah. Canonically. I feel like all things considered, it would also be canonical that Zack would beat the Shadow of Cloud. Well, yeah. In a fight. <laughs> I, I, are you, am I the only one losing track of who's who in this fight, by the way? Yes. <laughs> Jesus. Let's ban Final Fantasies from the, uh... Sure. Now, who have we not seen? That's, I have okay. to go by names. That's a little... Han, Lee, Sasuke. I don't think we've seen a Nova, Doza. right? Yeah. Yeah, I'll be Sasuke. I don't remember Inova. Mega Driver's ass, isn't Gak selling dick pills these days? Yes, when he's not selling, uh... What's his fucking side project band? Kentucky Fried... Not Kentucky Fried Chicken, that's Kentucky Fried something or other. And he has the greatest press conference of all time. The one where he says, What the fuck you looking at, asshole? Get the fuck out of here, asshole. One of the great moments in, in music industry and in, in promotion. 
My special, my projectile button is not a projectile. It is grab somebody. Oh, there's your grapple. Uh, Doza is the kickboxer back last Jazz. So we so we definitely saw Doza. Doza I know, right? Yeah, I know Doza. The, like, I think Doza is the one I'm going to go with. Got another guy with a sword. I told you Sasuke was really cool. And that Sakura is the beautiful. Are we ready for a final, or do we have anyone left? I don't think we've seen Lee. I don't think we've seen Han. Okay. Where's... I think these are the last two, then we go for... Let's fight on an elevator. I think we did elevator, but okay. No, we didn't. Ready! Uh, no, we do. There's a different thing. Okay, my character... Gate... The character I'm playing as when I was trying to do arcade mode like a couple years back, this guy was a fucking wall. Like, he, I eventually cheated and turned on like infinite health and shit, and it still took me forever to beat this guy just because he kept. The AI kept blocking everything. I call this one the high knee. Oh, wait. I feel like if I hit you while you're in the windup for that, it should like knock you out of it. Yeah, I should it just get exploded too. All right, you ready okay. for the match? Yeah, but I want to select it from the with the. Okay. With all this, so I want to make sure I'm selecting the right character too by looking at. Remember, Final Fantasies are banned. Right. Well, we also didn't check out Claire and, and Koji, maybe, but who, who gives we a shit? We checked out Claire. Right, but Koji's the other character from Quest, but it doesn't matter. It literally could not matter any less. Where's, wait, where's my guy? Oh, there he is. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I'm between these two. I think I usually play as Yo-Yo Yoko. But I think tonight I had some luck with Sasuke. Even though I've lost the night, I still want to try to get a win in this game. Gotcha. I think you have a good chance of Let's let fate decide. Oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck, Sharky? <laughs> this is the one character I'm good at. Apparently. Ah. <laughs> Alright, you got a perfect on me, so... Please stop rolling. <laughs> Why? Get up. <laughs> Fuck video oh. games. <laughs> Another one five nights. How does this even fucking happen, Sharky? 
Like, I'm not that what? bad at these games, am I? You I literally mean, have no, to wait. You're literally dialing into me through Parsec. You have, like, the latency is not on your side. You're playing it in a little corner of your screen, it, which you're not used to. And yet... <laughs> It, it always comes down to the wire, though. Every single one of these, when we have our match... That doesn't help me when I fucking up. lose! <laughs> that doesn't help me when, I, when I'm the one on the losing end of it. <laughs> but I'm saying you're not bad at it because it's a, it, it's a hard fight every time for me. <laughs> <sighs> All right, here's your fucking screen. And because you won the night, here's your screen again. <sighs> I suppose so. all that's left to ask now mm -hmm. is, Charky, what's my punishment? All right. So, we were having... Uh, a conversation in the hang room the other night um, and Don Bluth games came up. Oh no. And you talked about how much you hate all those games. So I want you to give it another shot. I want you to play s until the either the show's over or until you really can't handle it anymore, whichever comes first, play Space Ace for the Super Nintendo. Folks, that, that's that been tonight's show. That's, uh... <laughs> you gotta play at least a little bit of it before you throw in the towel. <sighs> I do not have the Super Nintendo version on hand. You'll have to give me a second. Okay. When did you get so mean? When did, did this show, like, turn you into I a worse person? I could have <laughs> said... I could have done the same bit and said uh, Dragon Slayer for NES, but I didn't. <sighs> okay. Give me a second to get it launched. I have to... Uh, let me actually hide that, just so in case it shows any of my file directory stuff. I don't think it will, but... Okay. And I think I'll have to probably do this one more time. Sure enough. This is Space Ace for the Super Nintendo. You don't have to go the full 40 minutes. If at a certain point you're like, nope, then that's fine. Empire Software. And who is the developer? Absolute? Uh, is this uh, Absolute in Empire Software? I think the audio is coming in a little. Let me see if it's minus five. Yeah, I thought so. Okay, well, um, okay. Well, that's absolutely un fucking readable. Right, Dexter here, Defender to the. Uh, Did you get any of that? Uh, Mega Drivers, go ahead, advertise. If you got a charity marathon to promote, go for it. <laughs> ODE production of an Absolute Entertainment Inc. game. Oh my god, you're just gonna roll demo. Okay. Mountainside. We're coming for you, uh, Robin Williams. Oh my god. <laughs> they tried. Yeah. By the way, I'm not going to be... Oops. 
I am not going to be so cruel as to say you can't rewind. <laughs> I love his less to the unlikely ass like grunts whenever he does anything. I love this auto scrolling. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. You got a giant dick in the background. Well, I mean, I remember one of the things in the intro said you need to recover your lost manhood. So there it is. There it is. It's, you run towards it. Go ahead, start from the very beginning. Fuck off. Oh, okay, so I can't... It just has to yes, be like... Yes, your sprite cannot intersect with it in any way, even if it doesn't, like, physically make sense. Uh! Why did the screen get all weird there for a second? No idea. Oh, cool, missed that. I'm trying to figure out, do I need to jump up here? Far out. Yeah, but then you... God, this is bad. Uh, Fuck! <laughs> I thought... Oh my god! Suck me on the... I, I was How thinking this about fucking... this. And I was thinking, like, wouldn't we really uh -huh. ever have another opportunity to play this? Okay, so there's like, no there's way back. Many. There's just no way back from this. Like, th this is impossible, what they're making me do. What they're attempting to get me to do here. Yeah, no, there's just no way back from grabbing yeah. this this thing, this far out thing or whatever. By the way, every button does the same shit, by the way. There's only... There's, there's four buttons, light. but for, the, for all intents and purposes. So I can't jump there. I think the... the uh, I... <laughs> the, does just jumping into them period hurt you? It's not even the laters? I think so. Okay, so fuck it. Fuck the red thing. We, that's impossible. That's just a trap that's hey. there to punish you. <laughs> what even... Ugh. Energize. So, I think if you had picked up the red thing, you would have been able to energize there and, like, get into your uh, manly form. Uh-huh! I think. There's no such thing as a second chance. Great, now I can't use rewind. Professor Gascad says stop using rewind. I, I would veto that, personally. <laughs> no, that's okay. I mean, because you're going to start from the start. There's no checkpointing. <laughs> I jumped too high. And it counted as, uh... Jumping off the cliff. Jumping How many lives do I cliff. have? Does this game just, like, go on forever? Because we're like, oh, yeah, this game's fucking bullshit. We made, like, a really bad game. So, like, let's not even worry about, like, lives. No, you're out of lives. This is your last... Well, you can't... You lost your last life. I didn't even have a chance to fucking react to anything. Game over. I'm fully aware it's of It's a bad one, doing. isn't it? Can't you see? Yeah, so we need to drink up. Points. Thank you. We have to find the answer by ourselves. Uh, say Can something you nice. The uh, you know, people got paid to make this game. Like someone, someone cast a paycheck, presumably. It didn't bounce, hopefully. So, you know, maybe like a family got fed off of this. But then, of course, you, you consider the fact that they starved people by making them uh, spend money on this fucking wretched dog shit. Mm -hmm. No more fooling around. Oh, thank God, we can rewind again. Thank you, Louise PSC. <laughs> I just want to get past one stage of this fucking nightmare game. Oh, Fuck so you want to go long tonight? Where can I fucking go? Where? <sighs> You re this is a really a game about like memorizing the exact. Well, that's locations. a bad game. In my mind, games like that I mean that suck my ass. That is, that is the Space Ace experience. I'm gonna try. I think uh, 
Someone said, holy shit, this game's on Steam, Pro Soccer 2. I, I, I'm assuming it's the actual Laserdisc version of this game. Yeah, I would have to imagine. Okay. Let me let me try diagonal. Oh my god, I got it, but I didn't get it. There it is! Okay. Uh, Energize? Video game, King, video game King asks if it was uh, Pico Interactive who put Space Ace on Steam. No, it is Digital Leisure. Yeah, it means it's the Laserdisc version. There it is. Now you can shoot and stuff. You'll still die in one hit. All right. I think you can shoot and stuff. I, I, I am really trying hard to remember this game. Can I rewind? Oh, yeah, okay. There's yeah, okay, one button yeah, that yeah. shoots. Oh, my God, but I can't shoot quick enough. Oh, my God, the first button makes you lock on. Then you need to press another button to actually shoot. Oh, uh, okay. What an unintuitive way to fucking do this. And then the scroll the screen in this direction... Oh, Cass, I'm sorry. I meant to pick a good game for your punishment. Yeah, you're right. I'm being mean for no reason. This is... <laughs> the buttons here are so bad. Oh, yeah. Nice trick, you fucking dicks. How am I supposed to do this when there's multiple targets to shoot? Oh, I see. I mean, I don't fully see, but... Well, let me get the Energize, you goddamn game. Far out. Why are we going back this way? What's there yeah, to do over fun. here? Are they gonna let me Energize again? No. So I fi I think, if I remember correctly, when you energize, energize might be optional, because I'm looking at how this progressed. Energize might be there for you to get points. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. No, stop scrolling. Stop scrolling. There we go. You can crash into something and die. Well, start the level over. You're a space hero, Cass. Why do they show the stats on the screen twice? Is this a two-player game? No, level stats and game stats. Oh, so right. If, you know. Well, that's as much of that as I'm ever going to fucking play. You don't want to see what the second level looks like? No, I'd rather, like, shoot myself into space without a spacesuit. I'd rather fly an Elon Musk rocket. I'm going to play my screen for this just because I feel like I fucking earned it. You it's may win. Okay. Apparently, I lost that. <laughs> yeah, well, you lost because you, you tried to punish me, tried to trap me and trick me, but I, I come out on top. I wanted yeah. you to win. <laughs> <laughs> and no matter how hard you try to put me down, Sharky, I'll keep getting back up. We'll keep that's doing good. these fight that's, nights. That's what I want. Do you succeed? No matter how many times you humiliate me, take my games that I like okay. away from me, say, Cass, I'm going to beat you in this and humiliate you in front of this that's, audience. That's, that's, as much as you pull up my, my underwear and give me a wedgie and that's you spit on me and kick that. me while I'm down. And for all these things, part. I'll still take the punishment like a champ. I'll still come all back right, swinging. <laughs> well played, Jarky. Thank you. A very you did well tonight as well. A very, very good punishment. Very good, mean punishment for you. Uh, I was fight night. That's three in a row, and these last two in particular have been particularly humiliating. <laughs> but that doesn't mean I won't come back and keep trying this. One of these days, I'll I'll land on the winning combination of games, the winning formula of of stuff, and uh. And maybe eke one out, just barely. Uh, 
that day will probably not come for a while. <laughs> but <laughs> we can continue to hold out hope. Uh, Mega Drivers, I, I think you said you wanted to promote a uh, charity stream of sorts. Oh, okay. I, I found the That's message here. Uh, they're going to be running Batman and Robin on the Sega Genesis, which, ooh, boy. That's actually a pretty good game, actually. I was thinking Batman Forever in my brain for a second there. It's uh, 9.15 Pacific Standard Time. Uh, they're collecting to battle climate change. They'll be demystifying a seemingly difficult game to a very easy one with a sick soundtrack. So let's go ahead, link that there, and shout out Mega Drivers. I think this is how this works. Yeah, I believe so. And I believe that's in an hour, more or less, from now. Yeah, so in lieu of a raid, I'm just going to point folk to that in advance. Please to check that out. Please to consider giving, because obviously climate change is... Well, this issues that affects us all, as it turns out. So, you know, invest in our futures. Uh, that being said, stream schedule plans for future... Uh, for, for the next few days. Tuesday... I think we'll be returning to Undermouth. I think we'll continue our descent. Uh, and I might drag you along with me All on right. that one, Sharky, oh. because I managed to oh. get it done solo the first time, but eesh, I need uh, someone to bounce off of for that. Also, oh, I just wanted to point out, how do I think this corrects me? Uh, that's Cherry Stream will be in about two hours, a little less than two hours. Very good. 9.15 PST. So maybe just consider just following now, like we gave the shout yeah. out and is it tuning in when that goes live? Uh, Thursday, are you going to get back to Resident Evil 6 with Sid? Yes, that is the plan. I, uh, was unavailable Thursday, the last minute, last time, unfortunately, but, uh, I do my damnedest <laughs> to put on this show, because I want to play this game. Very good. I do enjoy it. And then Saturday should be a return to the LGN connection. We're going to, it's bi-weekly, that one. So this has been the off week for it, next week will be the on week, then... Saturday after next, we'll probably come back with a theme night. It's been a while since we've done a good classic theme night. That's what I'm thinking for foreseeable future. And a Patreon poll will go up in the near future in order to uh, stimulate, you know, like uh, the audience engagement. Have y'all vote on what you want to see us play. Which, if you want to have a say in what we play, consider pledging to us on Patreon. Consider subscribing here on Twitch. Consider boosting us on Discord. Any one of these methods uh, will grant you access to a Patreon zone in the Discord server where you can participate in polls uh, and tell us what you want to see us play and uh, torture us as you see fit. You can see that I'm a glutton for punishments, so please, you know, don't hold back. If you're giving us money, if you're supporting us, supporting this goofy thing we do here on the Bad Game Hall of Fame, I think you're entitled to torture me a little bit, maybe. <laughs> That being said, I've been Cass. And I'm Sharky. Well played again. Thank you very much for uh, the lesson for the schooling in the across these games. And you know, I'll get you next time. I tell myself as I cry myself I'm, to I'm, sleep. <laughs> yeah, I'm expecting it's going to happen. One of these days, law of averages says that you got to have an off night one of these nights. But until that night, bye. Good night, everybody.